just uh, how was it out there? Have you uh, had experience doing this before? And if so, how did this pitch rank for you? Uh, I think this, well, let's start off with the ranking. I think this was number one on my ranking. I threw a strike, didn't skip it, uh, didn't lob it. Wasn't as much heat on it as I wanted, but um, no, this definitely ranks number one. I've thrown it out uh, in El Paso at a triple A game. We have uh, the Chihuahuas back at home where I'm from. Uh, so I've thrown one out there, and but it didn't go as good as this one. <laughs> All right, what kind of pressure is there on you compared to, say, first and goal at the three-yard line? Everybody expects you to deliver. There, you're out there on an island, have to deliver as well. Uh, it's a lot of pressure as well. You know, uh, you know you're know, you not a baseball player, so you're kind of worried about that, but all eyes are still on you, and they expect you to make it to the plate. So I think I passed tonight. <laughs> All right, last thing for you, just about uh, acclimating yourself. This is obviously something Minnesotans hold near and dear to their heart, Twins baseball. Uh, how is the acclimation process going, not just as a football and obviously learning the playbook, but becoming a Minnesotan? Uh, it's, it's becoming great, you know. Uh, I've came out to, to the city a couple times. I've got to catch a game as well, uh, the T-Wolves game, and the city's just showed me so much love, and I just want to say thank you for that. Uh, welcome me with open arms. Uh, you know, I'm here to play for you guys and uh, ultimately bring a championship back here. So uh, thank you to the city of Minnesota for welcoming me with open arms. Awesome.